Well, the marina in its configuration today has been here for 50, 60 years. However, historically, this was a place where rum runners ran during Prohibition, and there were boats coming in and out of here even before that time. So probably boats leaving from this bay for almost 100 years. What's unique about Canoe Cove is it is a community of marine professionals who love what they do and they love coming to this place to do it. So we have people working on all aspects of boats, old, new, wood, fiberglass, aluminum. It's just a great place for people to come and get work done. So Canoe Cove Marina is a full service marina and we offer transient moorage, annual moorage. We have a fuel dock, we have showers, we have laundry, we have washrooms, all the things that boaters would want along with our services. Plus we have a great coffee shop and the Stonehouse restaurant, which is a lovely pub built in the original boat builder's house on the property here. What I would say about Canoe Cove is it's one of the best kept secrets in Victoria. I think the Canoe Cove community is really nice because you have a, a group of companies here that are complementary to each other, that provide different services back and forth to one another at, at a very high level of quality. Well here at Raven Marine we provide pretty much a full service. A non-resident person can leave their boat here in Sydney, we look after it for them, we monitor it for security, we do all the maintenance, we provision. We can do flowers, laundry. We're like a full service hotel supporting yachts on the water. The joy of the Canoe Cove community for us is that everybody helps everybody else. So, you know, whether it's the fiberglass work we need, whether it's the lift, whether it's the channelry, what we bring to the Canoe Cove community is the fact that, first of all, the mechanical of the Mercury side, we bring that for Mercury, Mercruiser, all the outboard repairs. At our tender side, we offer tender repairs. So we'll do any of your inflatable repairs that are needed. Uh, at the boathouses down below, if your curtain has blown the open during the wind or is torn, we can repair those for you as well. So we're, we're diversified in three areas that help us uh, with the community. Black Line has been known since the beginning as a composite a facility, both in manufacturing and repair. When I say composites, I mean carbon fiber, fiberglass, all of those complicated finishing and structural issues that people run into with their vessels. This is where we started. This is still our core. Uh, the other activities of rigging and metal have been very complementary to that work. And to taken together, we provide that service that covers the entire external shell of the vessel, both power and sail. One thing I like about Canoe Cove is, is the sense of community. And people walk right in the shop, and if they need something, well, I'm here to help them. What we focus on is quality. We use the old traditional methods of sewing. We don't bind, we use the tabling method. So all layers and fasteners have four layers of material. It allows water runoff and keeps the dirt out of the trough of the binding. We don't cut corners, pardon the pun, but we use the best quality materials, and we do it the way it should be made. We build to custom order wooden sailboats and powerboats up to 62 feet so far to date. We also have one foot in the repair industry as well because that is what will fill in in between new contracts to build. So we prefer wooden boats but we end up doing interior modification on all kinds of boats. That's also woodwork and that's an area where our expertise can come in, uh, uh, come into play. Sea Power Marine has been in business for over 30 years. We are primarily a Volvo Penta dealership. We also do Suzuki repairs as well, outboard sales and service. Much of our work is done on the pleasure craft side of things. A good chunk of it is also done on the commercial side. So we'll do everything from a prawn boat to a 50-foot pleasure boat. Freedom Marine is unique in that we're a group of avid boaters. We all have boats. We boat regularly, so we're familiar with not only the boats, but the area. We have three locations, and we're the largest yacht broker for vessels over 50 feet in Canada. I think that what you'll find when you choose Freedom Marine to list your boat with, you'll find that we're friendly, honest, helpful, and successful. We do sell boats. Canoe Cove, aside from being just a great place where you can get all the services done here, you come into one parking lot and you can get your bottom painted, you can sell your boat, you can get canvas made, so that's great, but it's also just a really unique setting. It's a beautiful part of the world and it never gets tiring looking out the window. Our community down here perceives itself. We got a lot of awesome quality people, a lot of awesome quality businesses down here. My favorite dishes here are the crab cake benny, the smoked salmon benny, the fish and chips, 
and our house pasta. Our house pasta during the summer season is to die for. When people ask me to create a painting, I generally do a couple of sketches, often in color, and these are quite small, but uh, that people can get a general idea from that what the finished image is going to be like. Prince Philip has my work. I think he has three pieces of my work, one of which I presented to him personally. Queen Elizabeth also has a piece of my work which was presented to her as a personal gift. And my work has been on the cover of various magazines. The Stonehouse Pub is very unique. Its location makes it very unique on the waters of Canoe Cove. It's a historic stone-built building, over 85 years old, that has quite the history of pub and restaurant. The type of food that we offer reflects the area. It's on the ocean, it's proximity to all the farms in the Saanich Peninsula, and also in the wine region. So a lot of our recipes and our menu items reflect all those components. When people ask me about Canoe Cove, sometimes I say it's stuck in the 60s in a great way. It's just a lovely little community, it's a heritage building, and it's just a neat spot.